So Citizen of the Year, yep. I'm going to go make that award this morning. And um, in full disclosure, I know the Citizens of the Year. Mm -hmm. There's two of them. We have co-Citizens of the Year. That's happened a few times in the history of Grimes. Yep. And uh, this year, um, I didn't have a vote on this, um, but I would have voted for him if I could. It's Denny and Elaine Knutson. Yep. And uh, Elaine is one of the co-directors at the Grimes Storehouse, which is the food pantry for Grimes. And Denny is like super volunteer. So I'd say he's like a third co-director, but he'll never accept that title because he's a humble <laughs> person. And they're just wonderful people. Um, there's not much to say about them that I think most of the community doesn't already know, but I wanted to read to you guys just a paragraph from the nomination that was submitted on their behalf because I think it's phenomenal. Mm -hmm. the, the last paragraph that we received was, I think Denny and Elaine are great examples to all of us. Their perspective is that it's a privilege and a joy to serve each and every day. They are grateful and blessed for their opportunity. They are exceptional humans. Now, if anybody ever writes a paragraph like that about you, count yourself blessed. Um, Denny and Elaine are blessed, but we as a community are blessed to have them with us. And so it's going to be fun to go surprise them mm -hmm. with this award. Although don't be surprised if they're humble when they receive it because that's just the type of people they are. And we get a surprise Elaine on her birthday. So it's her today's birthday. also her <laughs> yeah. birthday. So it'll be a fun surprise to yeah. give that to her for her birthday. Double surprise. Yeah. <laughs> All, right, All right, let's go do it. Sounds good. I said I want to come in and talk to Elaine and Denny both and that's because this year um, we're doing something a little bit different down at the chamber and it's relevant to your positions here at the Grimes Storehouse um, but really about you as people um, you guys were nominated and were subsequently selected to be our co-citizens of the year that's right <laughs> So here, we even got a little uh, deal for you here. Come on over here a little bit. I see you. And then wow. this is this. You don't have to make any big speeches, um, but I want you to know um, how highly people think of you. Um, we tried to express that to you when we're in board meetings, and uh, you know, I know you as neighbors too, so it's a little bit different. So in addition to being great, humble, passionate, caring people, um, they have a great lawn, and uh, <laughs> I don't know about that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So they're hard to keep up with um, as neighbors, um, but really, you guys do set the example for the types of people that um, we like to have in our community. Um, I think you're great examples, and that's what we heard of the nomination. But honestly, we knew it a long time before then. Um, so congratulations! Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Thanks, Brian. You guys get you guys get to keep this. Oh, and you know, oh, we forgot about one very important thing. <laughs> Elaine, we realized too that in addition to being citizen of the year, it's your birthday. So happy birthday. <laughs>